The Hare Krishna say the 25 people held in the Soviet Union are being detained simply because they belong to the faith. They claim one 11-month-old baby girl died recently because she was allowed only limited contact with her mother. They sang outside the Soviet consulate before releasing white peace doves into the grey Sydney skies. The Hare Krishnas say they fear for the health of their devotees in Russia. They're given many drugs which more or less turn somebody into a vegetable. We're fearful, first of all, for their very sanity because many of the drugs they've been given are turning them insane. Today's protesters included many children from the Hare Krishna school at Mavulambar on the north coast who made their own plea to the Soviet officials. We would like to come to the Soviet Union and meet the Soviet children, maybe even your children, and show you that there is no harm in the Hare Krishna lifestyle. The Hare Krishna say today's demonstration is only the first in a number around the world to free their friends in the Soviet Union. Russ Street, Eyewitness News. to be the universal language so what better way to ask for world peace than through a song and that's exactly what 12 year old Prahlad has done Krishna and peace is an important part of his life. Prahlad and the Krishna kids recorded the song Please Let Our Friends Go as a plea to the Russian leader to release 25 Hare Krishnas imprisoned in the Russian jails. write the song? Well, I thought that because we have freedom in this country, I also think that we should have freedom in the USSR and everywhere else in the world. What does being a Hare Krishna mean? Well, being a Hare Krishna, we serve God and God's representative, our spiritual master. Is there anything special that you do as a Hare Krishna? Um, yeah, we do singing and dancing in our temples. And I noticed the painted stripe down your nose. What's that for? Oh, well, it's like a uniform, just like a police man. He has a car, big siren on the top and everything, big hat. So we have, you know, shaven head, dhoti, tilak, like that. Is that what it's called? Yeah, tilak. Tilak. And what's the dhoti? It's a cloth. Um, <laughs> the record will work? Do you think there will be world peace? Well, if everyone really wants it, if all the children really try to help, then I think we will eventually, we will see the start of the 21st century and we will have world peace. You liked it? Great, thank you. Gorby just rang up, he loves it. 